Let me ask you, General, you know, the, the, you have the governor now, the elected representative from Puerto Rico, asking for this Jones Act to be waived. Look, it's really complicated what's happening. Some of the, you know, the stuff may be getting to port, but not getting to where it's needed. They say that it would speed delivery rapidly for this act to be lifted. The point, though, is this, that the president's response, when asked about whether he would lift it, when he did for Florida and Texas with Harvey and Irma, he responded this way about Puerto Rico. Here he is. Well, we're thinking about that, but we have a lot of shippers and a lot of people and a lot of uh, people that work in the shipping industry that don't want the Jones Act lifted. What's your response to that, General? The president seems concerned about the shipping industry. I want to keep it clean. That's a crime damn shame. Uh, I knew since yesterday that big shots in Wall Street were making this call. And the president has shown again he don't give a damn about poor people. You don't give a damn about people of color. And the SOB that rides around in Air Force One is denying services needed by the people of Puerto Rico. I hate to say it that way, but there's no other way to say it. So you, you, this second-class citizens, which is obviously what we said uh, at the top of the show, you're, you, you sound like you're saying to you this is, this is also a race issue? I'm reading in it just like he read about why guys call SOBs to... Uh, mostly African Americans who kneel during the uh, national anthem. And he's got that liberty. As a citizen, I have that liberty. 